Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Up until this week, my iPad 2 was naked. Kind of half naked, really, because I had the smart cover on the top, and that was fine. It kept the screen protected, and that's really what I was looking for uh, in a case. And uh, they didn't have the smart cover uh, with the first generation iPad. And then Targus asked if I wanted to take a look at uh, their keyboard case. And I thought, well, why not? They're sending one to review. Every other keyboard and keyboard case that I had tried had fallen short, if only because of the responsiveness of the keys. Sometimes they would be too mushy, and I'm like, I'm not going to use that. I would never use that. So I thought, hey, I'll give it a shot. And so now uh, I have uh, a keyboard case. Charges by way of uh, mini USB, which is nice, because I have plenty of those cables lying around. It's got a strap here on the, the top or the front or the back. I don't, I don't know which way you'd say. Oh, yeah, you can see the, uh, the Apple logo right there. Uh, that keeps the case closed if I'm uh, moving around with it. So uh, I, I like it. I, I genuinely do like it. Oh, there's my Google Plus open there. I can go ahead and I can lock the screen by tapping that key. And I know you're saying, well, Chris, at the point where you're using a keyboard or wanting to use a keyboard, why don't you just get a, a netbook or a notebook? Well, first, netbooks are underpowered. And, 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 and second, uh, notebooks are a bit too big for what I'm looking for. And, and third, this has got a touch screen. So uh, <laughs> I was happy with that. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with the case, too. The, the responsiveness of the keyboard, uh, it happens to be, to me, reminiscent of Apple's keyboard. Um, I would say a good feel. Um, I didn't feel my uh, hands, uh, you know, were, I guess, cramped. Uh, I have small hands. But I, I didn't feel like I was reaching too far to get to one key or another. Uh, and I didn't feel the keys are too, uh, I guess, um, close together. The one thing that I, I, I can tell you uh, I didn't like about the keyboard was that uh, they mapped some characters oddly in order to accommodate the size of the keys. Uh, like they had to move the question mark. Sorry, I'm going to see if I turn this off as I'm pressing all these keys. They had to move the question mark as a function uh, under N instead of the regular location. So sometimes in my mappings, I'm, 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 I'm used to going one direction or another for, for certain keys since I'm a touch typist. Uh, they also moved the option key to the right side of the cursor keys, which was odd for me, but I understand why, because again, they were trying to accommodate larger key sizes. And I, I think that was a good sacrifice to make, truth be told. A little awkward in, in the sense that I, I, they're, the, some characters are not in the same locations I expect them to be, uh, but in order to accommodate all these keys, they pretty much had to make sacrifices somewhere. And I think Targus did make the right decision. So some of the cases I've seen are not very versatile in the sense that you pop this out and there it is. Well, what if you want to, you know, orient your iPad in a vertical view? It's easy to do in this case. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, very convenient, very easy. Uh, you can uh, turn the keyboard on or off back here. There's a switch on, off on see you see it's on there it's got a little bluetooth key it's already been synced i don't know if you can see that bluetooth light go up it'll also tell me if the battery needs charged and then back here behind the ipad we have a place for you to insert a stylus so they, they've really they, they've thought of a few things that i would expect them to think about uh, not just a, 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 i would say as far as a ipad keyboard case is concerned a solid keyboard as solid as, it, as they can be it's not clunky uh it, it's not uncomfortable uh, they've accommodated a stylus, they've accommodated uh, the two different positions uh, for the iPad, and they've made it clean. The only thing I would give them, uh, I guess, uh, negative marks for on the case is that they put their logo here. But it's, a, it's, it's small, but I, I don't like that. I, I don't. I genuinely don't. If, if they were going to do anything, they could have put it inside somewhere, and that would have been fine, because I would remember, oh yeah, it's Targus. But putting them on the outside, to me... Kind of tacky, and I realized, hey Chris, you got a, a big uh, Apple logo. Uh oh, it's upside down. What's Apple going to? Actually, if you hold it upside down, that's like uh, uh, anti-Apple. I don't, I don't know. It doesn't bother me a bit. Um, but you know, it's it's part of that particular product, and you know, you want to show off that you have an iPad. It's a nice way of accommodating uh, the pivot point uh, for uh, rotating uh, the iPad too. They've accommodated the speaker, the uh, sync port. Uh, the uh, charging port, uh, your microphone, uh, your, uh, uh, your rocker switches, and uh, the, res oh, the camera, of course, uh, can also be found there. Oh, actually, there. sorry about that if I was covering up any aspect of it. 
Uh, not bad. Uh, should run under $50. And if you're looking for a keyboard or a keyboard case for your iPad 2, I think this one might fit the bill. Uh, I have not purchased any others because everyone that I tried I was not happy with. This is the only one that I've received to review. And I, I, until I find something better, I, I'm going to stick with this one. Uh, if you want, uh, I can try to get you a discount. Go.tagjag.com slash Targus iPad. And then I will you know, send you off to where I can find the lowest price for you. Um, if you know of a better case that can accommodate a keyboard, a stylus, a, a pivoting point, it's very comfortable, it's very clean, uh, let me know. My email address, chris at perillo.com. Thanks again to Targus for sending this along, really. Because if I spent all the money that I could possibly spend on gadgets, gizmos, and accessories... I would be in the poorhouse, and then I would not be recording videos. I'd be doing other... What would I be doing? If I, here's a question for you. What would I be doing if I wasn't doing this? I don't know. Possibly still writing on LockerGnome.com. We'll see you later.